Hey everyone, today we're making the best green chutney ever. Green chutney is just absolutely a must if you're having kebabs or tikkas um, or in gourmet sandwiches and it's just uh, delicious. If you make this green chutney, you'll be serving it with just about anything. It's really simple to make. If you follow this recipe, you will be making the best green chutney ever. So for this, the main ingredient that we will need is fresh coriander or cilantro. We need 80 grams of fresh coriander leaves. We also need some mint, about two tablespoons of fresh mint leaves. So we're going to add this to a small blender along with one small hot green chili, one large clove of garlic and a small piece of ginger, just about the same size as your garlic. To this we're going to add half a cup of really thick yogurt. And our special ingredient that makes it so delicious and creamy is sour cream. Add up to 6 tablespoons of sour cream. We're going to add 3 tablespoons first. And we also need our chutney to be nice and sour, so we're going to add 3 teaspoons of lime juice. Fresh lime juice. And for that authentic flavor of a green chutney, you need kala namak or black salt, half a teaspoon. If you don't have this, you can add regular salt, as well as half a teaspoon of cumin seeds. Again, to add that to a blender and blend till it's nice and smooth. We're going to add 3 more tablespoons of the sour cream at the end. You can adjust the sour cream and the thickness to your personal preference. So I'm also adding a little bit more of the black salt. And that's it. Our delicious, creamy, smooth green chutney is ready. You can store this in the fridge. Uh, it stays fresh for over a week. Uh, just store it tightly. And for a simple recipe, just take soft white bread slices and spread the green chutney over the bread slices. And to make the sandwiches on the other slices, add some cold cubes of butter, just tiny little uh, cuts of cold butter. I'm using salted butter here. And just cut these sandwiches into little bites and serve them. It's a really refreshing and cooling sandwich bite. That's just a little something to get you hooked on this delicious green chutney. Serve it with kebabs, tikkas, in wraps. It's just perfect with anything. So hope you tried this quick recipe. Let me know if you tried. Thanks a lot for watching. Bye.